If you're bad at drawing like I am, then stay tuned because I'm going to show you 10 AI text to image software that you can use to generate an image from a simple text description or enhance your images. Now let's get started. The very first one I'd like to introduce to you is called Vance AI. And it has many solutions to enhance your image. The very first one could be an image in, enlarger, right? So you can enlarge your image. They have an AI anime upscaler, a background remover, a JPEG artifact remover, a portrait retoucher, AI photo dehazer, image compressor, passport photo maker. And then they even have image cropper, image resizer, rotator, flipper, AI photo colorizer, AI photo retoucher, and then AI photo restorer and, and lots of other stuff. Let me just show um, what the AI background one is going to look like. All right, so this one is simple. You use your, your photo that you want to remove the background and it will trace it. Now it helps to have the image have a high contrast and be clearly defined. So what I mean, uh, the background has to not be this very same color as your the skin or the person that you're trying to remove. Otherwise it's going to cut into and, and, and mix up the back or uh, the image and might, it might cut part of the person out. So for the best results, make sure it's a very high contrasting background to then in order to be able to get the best results from them. Okay. So the next image AI generator that I'd like to show you is deep AI. And this is a interesting text to image API that you can use to create image from scratch using a simple text description. Now, let me give you an example. I'm on a dog cat. Well, and this is what you get. It's a very unique, uh, I don't know, a cute raccoon skunk. Uh, I guess your mileage will vary. But it's definitely a fun tool to, I guess, either get inspired or just to uh, play around with. Okay, the next text to image generator I'd like to introduce to you is called Allen Institute for AI. All right, and from here, you can just simply enter a caption or choose one from the examples. I'm just going to go one with the. All right, so two people play video games while sitting on the couch. And then I'm just going to go ahead and run the model. Now, oh, this one's a lot quicker. And well, this is a bit wonky. I guess you can kind of see a person. <laughs> and I don't know. I don't know what this is right here. And it looks like they're sitting on something that lo looks kind of like a couch. But this is a bit creepy. <laughs> All right. Let's move on. Okay, so the next text image generator is called Night Cafe. And you can easily create artworks from nothing but a text prompt. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and say something like, I'll keep it simple again. Okay. Cat, dog. I want to. All right, and this is what it generated. It just generated, oh, I guess you can look at it real quick, the cat dog. And I guess it's a cat next to a dog or maybe a cat on top of a dog on a couch or something. It looks interesting. It looks better than the other ones I've seen. So much, much more artistic. And I guess it allows you to download, you can print it out. It, it has more user-friendly options. Like it's more developed than the other I've shown you. So that's Night Cafe. All right, the next text image generator is a generative engine. So let's go ahead and start. It's a storytelling machine that automatically generates synthetic images. As okay, so you click on let's start. Write something to generate images. Let's start with. All right. Hmm. Cat playing with dog. All right. These are 
No. Nah. Yeah. Hmm. It's interesting. Uh, it, it generates something that resembles a cat or a dog at times, and other times it looks like an abstract art. So I think it needs to be more touch school, very depending on what you type in here, but uh, it didn't really do a decent job with the cat dog concept that I, I have been testing with all AIs. Let's move on to the next one. Okay, so the next one is Deep Dream Generator. All right, and let's see. Human AI collaboration is what it claims. So Deep Style. Uh, capable of using its own knowledge to interpret a painting style and transfer it to the uploaded image. That's it. So in this case, it shows an image of a lady's face and a Japanese art style, and it combines the two. Then it could do thin style. This tool is a simplified version of deep style one. And it is not capable of creating advanced still shines with some exceptional results. So I guess it, it, it does something similar to this one, but like deep style light. And then it has deep dream. And it was initially invented to help scientists and engineers to see what a deep neural network is seeing when it is looking in a given image. Later, it has become a new form of abstract art. So, you know, very interesting here. And of course, you can get started. And try it out for yourself. And deep dream generator. Next one I'd like to introduce, uh, we've done this one already, is generated anonymizer. Okay, so this is a very specific AI, text to AI generator. It basically uses your image and modifies it so that you can then get privacy. <laughs> right, so upload your photo into generated photos. Very, very interesting. So, uh, the concept is you have your real self, you upload it and you have a generated AI self, right? And it uses your skin, age, gender, hair length, etc., to create a, an AI avatar, visual avatar. And then it gives you, it gives people an idea of what you look like while still protecting your identity and it's completely simple. So you can use your new face without having to worry about, you know, uh, copyright like, uh, issues and stuff. And you can go ahead and test it out here. Uh, I'm not going to go ahead and do that because, <laughs> uh, I value, I still value my, my privacy and I, I'm not sure if this, how well this will work, but you can go ahead and play. The only thing I have against it is it's very, very niche. <laughs> so uh, if you don't want to use your photo now you can't really use your photo for anything else right you can only use your portrait to generate an ai avatar but it's an interesting concept let's move on the next one is called dynamic image and you, you type the text in here that's interesting All right. Well, I think that still needs a bit of work. Let's go on to the next one. The next one is called artbreeder.com. And its catchphrase is extend your imagination. So this one likes to help you harness machine learning to create amazing images in seconds. And these are the different images in Italy. Artistic and creepy at the same time. I, I like it though. I definitely like it. So you can go ahead and log in and, and, and see for yourself. Here are a few other images. Let's check it out. So these are the trending ones and you can just click on random ones and they, they range in, in different, they range in, in what they are. Some are anime, some are portraits. So it looks very, very interesting. Check that out. The last one is, okay, so it's a text to image generator. Let's see. Okay, so it's a, a free image editing tool. All right. 
So some of these will help you to enhance your image. Some of them will help you to edit your image and some of them will help you to create your own images. And between a, the combination of these tools, you should be able to create very unique pieces of artwork or come up with visual ideas to help you generate um, some kind of visual concepts. Inclu even if you're very bad at drawing like I am or not as creative as other people. 